What's up guys, Emo10 here and today I'm going to be showing you how to increase performance of Mass Effect Andromeda. Damn! Look at those PC requirements. I can hear my computer screaming in the background. The first thing we are going to do is to go to your settings and go to your video output and change your display mode to window. Make sure to also turn off VSync mode, high dynamic range and triple buffer. Changing the display mode allows you to change the resolution to any resolution you want because as you can see, it says here 1280 to 720 but there it says 857 to 582. Changing your resolution increases your performance dramatically. Before changing my screen resolution, playing the story mode of the game was impossible because during the middle of the first cutscene, the game crashed and was telling me that my graphics card had crashed. So, reaching up to this moment, it's only changing the screen resolution that has helped me right now. Also, changing the screen resolution comes in handy when the game is loading. Before changing my screen resolution, the game was loading for up to 20 minutes. Having the option to change the screen resolution, I changed it to the lowest possible and it took me only 5 minutes. So, when the game is loading, make sure to turn the screen resolution to the lowest because trust me, loading can be, in this game can become a bit when it comes to loading. So, this is how the game looks like after reducing it to 580p. So, you, we're gaining an average of 19 FPS because it's bouncing, it's coming from 18 to 20 FPS. Yeah, but you can go further and change it by tweaking the game. To tweak the game the first thing you're going to do is to hold control alt and the tilde map to open up the, the game console now all you have to do is follow me and write these codes as I write them but if you can't catch up I have left all the codes I used in the description below
Note that all these codes will affect your graphics but will improve your performance. But the world render the light tile CS path enable one will take away a lot of light from your cutscenes. So if you're a person who likes watching cutscenes, I will advise you not to use that. Now if you've paid close attention to the FPS, it was increasing as I was putting in this tweak. So this is proof that this tweak will work. And if they have helped you, please leave a like, comment what game you want to see next, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. This was MO10 and I'm out. Peace.